of you. May you uphold the word you've talked about a lawyer. TikTok Kenya must be disciplined. This is enough. For the first time we have seen someone bringing a notebook with reference numbers of M-Pesa written on it. Also, we need a lawyer. And that lawyer must clear everything. If, if they've said you did not send money, get a lawyer and get your money back. Let us grow up, TikTok Kenya. Let us grow each other. Let us not bring each other down. We need the one million account for this young man here. This is a young man. He's not an old man. He's not our age. I've watched him waiting as numbers click to get to one million. The moment it clicks to one million, he's silent for Yeni kidogo ladies and gentlemen. Na wambia mambo ya nazidi kuchemuka. My friend, uyu jama anaitwa babati. Babati ameweza kuleta wazi ni nini haswa iliweza kumfanya. akaweza kukosana na shosho wa muenda zake branchira. My friend, kuna uyu mtoto wa, muenda, wa shosho. Ambaya anaitwa njeri ama sijui nani huyu. Ambaye alikuwa... Eh? amekuwa ameishi na bwana yake lakini the moment wana tiktoka waliweza kuchanga hiyo pesa huyu mtoto wa shira ama huyu msichana wa shosho wa shira aliweza kutoka kwa bwana yake akakuja kuishi na shosho jo alijua shosho amepata pesa mingi na my friend ile the time bonfire waliamua waweze kupeleka shosho na baba Talisha kule Mombasa Bab, shosho aliweza kuambia baba Talisha unajua bonfire ilikuwa imesimamia shosho na ria na, na mtoto mwingine mmoja Hmm? ni wao wawili na shosho wangapi wote watatu na plus babati wakakuwa waine can you imagine shosho akalazimisha akasema lazima aende na huyo msichana yake mkubwa na huyo msichana pia abebe watoto wake ni lazima awalipie ndege babati akamwambia hiyo haiwezekani juu hii pesa ambayo unataka twende na huko ni ya public na hii pesa walikuwa wamechanga ni ya kujenga nyumba hmm? Shosho akawaka wakakasirikiana so my friend baba ti anajaribu kuleta ni anajaribu kueleza ni nini haswa iliweza kumkosanisha na shosho washira so hiyo video nitawatplayia hapo jinsi baba ti aliweza kujieleza na pia tumsikiza kwa makini na kama kweli unaona mambo ambayo anaweza kuzungumza ni kweli unaweza drop your comment hapo na pia kama kwa against baba ti lakini mimi i salute baba ti ameweza kujieleza na siku zote ukitaka kukwepa mtego ama maneno ya watu kuwa na record na baba T alikuwa mjanja akaweza kuna kili kila kitu chini ambaye alikuwa anafa anafanya so guys i hope to enjoy the video pamoja mpaka hadi mwisho so let's go Mombasa ikakuja shosho akasema amefusiwa shosho wanted huyu msichana wake Regina na watoto wake wote waende wapi Mombasa Bonfa akasema that one is it will be too expensive because now the people that were in picture with the, with with shosho alikuwa tu ni Ryan na Ian peke yake si ndio sasa ikakuaje tena ati Regina atoke pale so the problem was niliambia shosho after tumerudi shosho akasema aje ati anataka kulipia Regina na watoto wake wafanye nini waende Mombasa how is that possible na sa mchango tuanze hapo tu i'm being very clean with this that is where the problems are regina has his own family has her own family alitoka kwa bana yake amekuja kuishi na shosho saa hii how is shosho going to manage regina na watoto wake sijui ni watata ama sijui wawili how how is she going to manage regina mtoto wake na wajuku wote tukwe tu serious tu now if i ask this shosha nasema na muongelesha vibaya how am i being a bad person because i'm asking the accountability of the money that i contributed online how the house anasema nyumba at 5 million renovation mtu mgana atakupata renovation na 5 million kama hujampata zile vitu unataka how will you want a house that is looking like zile nyumba ziko westlands ndio unaishi kidurai unataka kujengoa nyumba inaka kama ya huko na unataka dance home ifanye how was baba talisha responsible kusema ya anaenda kufanyisha thanksgiving i did not say baba talisha mimi naenda kufanya hivyo 
like learn to respect me now that's why nikasema sitai kuja tena kwa mitanda right now i'm trending on tiktok eh, on twitter at me nimekula pesa matanga and then instagram ni matusi tu and then kwa comment section zote ni matusi matusi you killed who is momani sijui nini like everything 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 nilisema hivi money is the root of all evils and i knew one day will come where by ndakuja kukaa hivi at sasa nianze kusema vile pesa zilitumika like for what for what baba baba ti baba ti sasa naweza pigia naweza pigia wewe shosho simu hata shika simu yangu let me do that right now okay now go to baba ti i want to do that okay so i am emotional for funeral i did not even contribute even a cent for this funeral but i am emotional because kenyans we have to change on this pace you cannot see a man come sleepless nights just because you want to make cases on any contribution any time you see money has crossed over a million kenyan shillings you want to make a case out of it why do you compete on who should get more money or who should get more coins off of a funeral this young man is standing in his grave right now this man is this young boy suffered when he was alive let this boy rest in the bosom of christ right now stop wanting clout of kobe dan look for clout come i will even host you on my life for you to get clout from the whole world come and get clout from cancer patients and everything get clout but get off getting clout from a dead man i'm trembling because this this is pathetic this is out of this world a man who is a single man right now he's talking and muting and saying please i want to take care of my child right now give me a minute and he turns and speaks to his young guy and comes back to address you people stop it rosso i have never addressed you but please i beg of you may you uphold the word you've talked about a lawyer TikTok Kenya must be disciplined. This is enough. For the first time we have seen someone bringing a notebook with reference numbers of Mpesa written on it. Rosso, we need a lawyer. And that lawyer must clear everything. If if they said you did not send money, get a lawyer and get your money back. Let us grow up TikTok Kenya. Let us grow each other. Let us not bring each other down. We need the 1 million account for this young man here. This is a young man. He's not an old man. He's not our age. I've watched him waiting as numbers click to get to 1 million. The moment it clicks to 1 million, his silent followers we are celebrating. The next thing, the account is gone. I want you to know Baba Talisha. I have written to TikTok. And a number of us are writing to TikTok. We are letting TikTok know what is happening in the Kenyan TikTok space. Because it is witch hunt. Tedball competition. Let us build each other not make each other fall. Enough of competition. Enough of content creation that may lead to murder content creation that may lead to suicides it is enough young man you have shown us everything we wanted to see young man take care of your child you are respected you are honored and you are feared god has given you a shine that nobody can take from you Your light is shining on the mountain. Your salt can be tested. Do not let anybody dim your shine. Do not keep your light and I've heard you say 
Whenever some other people have problem, you will never go there. Don't stop your shine. If Jesus Christ of Nazareth was crucified, who are you? You will be crucified. Not now. Alone. You will be crucified forever. But do not ever dim your shine. You have supporters that you don't know. We are your silent supporters and we are proud of you. Thank you so much, MC Chris, for allowing me, me to come up here. I have never, you people are my witnesses, I have never yes. come to such a space. But today I came because you, this young man, has won my heart and the hearts of many. Thank you so much. To my guys, mmesikiza hiyo voice ama mmesikiza video baba team mmeiwachi mpaka mwisho mmejua ni kwa nini waliweza kukosana na shosho before mambo ianze kuchemka. Kumbe hiyo ndio ilikuwa chanzo ya shosho kuanza ku, ku differ na yeye. Na pia kuna mahali wakati Obida aliweza ku visit shosho pia, hiyo pia ilichangia baba team kuanza kukosana na na shosho. So guys nitakuwa nazidi ku update kile ambayo inaendelea kwenye mtandao ama baba team na shosho jinsi wanaendelea kwenye mambo za so guys keep tuning kwa 254 digital news kama ujaweza kunifollow na kwamba unifollow ili uweze kupata mapya kutoka kwenye platform yote kote nchini so guys nawashukuru sana na Mungu awabariki